Hi there, this is Mrs. Woods. We're going to go over a review lesson for compound sentences, fanboys, dependent and independent clauses, and complex sentences. Today, our lesson goals will be I will be able to identify fanboys, compound and complex sentences, independent clauses, and dependent clauses, and I will be able to complete the review activity. To review, what is a subject? Who does the action or is something? What is a predicate? The action in the sentence or what something is. Simple sentence, one complete thought, a subject plus a predicate. Example, Santa is real. Compound sentence, two simple sentences combined using a comma and a fanboys. Example, Santa is real, but the Easter Bunny is not. Coordinating conjunctions or fanboys the words that combine two sentences. Fanboys are for, and, nor, but, or, yet, so. So just like any other skater boy always has his skateboard. So a fanboys will always have a comma. Don't forget the comma. Mrs. Woods loves Sonic comma, and she buys it every Friday. Miss Jacobson only drinks Diet Dr. Pepper, comma, so her insulin stays under control. Miss Henson loves Coke, comma, yet she only drinks it on Fridays. Miss Shaw loves Dr. Pepper, comma, for it is her favorite liquid to drink. Miss Williams drinks sweet tea only, comma, or she will drink water. Clauses, independent, dependent. An independent clause, it has a subject and a predicate and all the information it needs to stand alone. It's another name for a simple sentence. So we have Santa Claus here. He's independent, he can make all the gifts and he can deliver all the toys all by himself. A dependent clause, is half a thought, looks like a sentence, but it is missing information, does not pass the guess what test. Subordinating conjunction, the word at the start of the dependent clause. Just like an elf, can't quite function on its own, it can make things, it can do things, but an elf can't deliver all the gifts by themselves, can't drive the sleigh, can't do all the things that Santa can do. So the elf is dependent on Santa. Since I was not good, even though I helped my mom, after I wrapped the presents, while we watched the movie Elf. These are all examples of dependent clauses. Complex sentences is an independent clause plus a dependent clause equals a complex sentence. No comma is needed. Independent clause plus dependent clause equals Complex sentence, or in this case, Christmas happens. No comma is needed. Dependent clauses at the beginning of a sentence must have a comma. Dependent clause plus a comma plus an independent clause equals a complex sentence. Dependent clause, RL, plus a comma plus your independent clause, Santa, equals a complex sentence, or Christmas happens. Since I was not good, I got coal in my stocking. Even though I helped my mom, she still grounded me. After I wrapped the presents, I placed them under the tree. While we watched the movie Elf, we decorated sugar cookies. When I turned in all my missing assignments, I had a passing grade. Independent clauses at the beginning of the sentence do not need a comma. I got coal in my stocking since I was not good. My mom still grounded me even though I helped her. I placed the presents under the tree after I wrapped them. We decorated sugar cookies while we watched the movie Elf. I had a passing grade when I turned in all my missing assignments. Now let's practice. In your writer's notebook, go to your third six weeks tab. The assignment is called Complex Sentences Review. Be sure to submit your OneNote link in Canvas.